Nor do I. We're probably going to be the swaggiest character to ever step foot in Hogwarts. That's going to be our legacy. What is this, like old magic? Okay, Man, okay. Bit. How did you... Wait! We did... Oh! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs>
Professor Weasley. Ooh, is that a is that a descendant of the Weasley family? Duh. Deputy Headmistress. Wow, I didn't know the Weasleys um, had a professors in the family. Well, this game, I think it does take place like 100 years before the current events of Harry Potter or the, the known timeline of Harry Potter uh, and even before the timeline of Dumbledore. So uh, it's going to be interesting to see even the lore that the game presents there. It's like, it's like a brand new world and a brand new book within this amazing, amazing, amazing universe. Um, so let's see. So speaking of representation, it is time for me to decide how I'm going to represent myself in this game. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. You just see, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. You see just the way the hair bounces on the, on the entry. Okay. 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 I see you. I see you Hogwarts legacy. I see you. Y'all represent. He got the clean fade. So we'll, we'll start here. And let's get into some customization. Okay, I don't know, y'all. This is kind of swaggy. I might have to rock these. I look like an OG on the campus. I might have to rock those. I might have to rock those. Actually, actually, first, first, let's just. So it, it doesn't look like they let you, you know, fiddle with the actual face shape too much, which I get, which I get, because this game couldn't, with as much that is in this game, they couldn't dump everything into character customization. I'm pretty sure more your, uh, the things that you find in the game, like how you dress, the aesthetics are probably where this will be more, more focused on, which is very similar to how Elden Ring was. Like, I don't even think you ever saw your character's face in Elden Ring. So yeah, we'll, we'll just stay here. We'll just stay here. All right, and let's, let's mess with some hair, hairstyles. Actually, first, let's just see the range. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, my brother. Okay, I, it's giving Sean King. It's giving Sean King. It's giving, it's giving logic. Okay, I like it. I like it. It's giving logic. Um, let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got here. Uh, 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 I, was I here before? I don't think I was that far in. Um, yeah, I, I'd say I'm about here. This is like my winter coat because I get a little bit lighter in the winter. In the summer, I'm about here, but I don't think I'm that red. So I'll, I'll, I'll go here. I'll go here. I'll go here. All right. Now let's, let's, let's jump into, let's jump into these hairstyles. Let's jump into these hair. Oh my God, bro. You need a, you need a pick immediately. Um, let's see. Let's see. We got some, we got some braid. Ooh, look at the texture. All right, all right. I don't know. Yeah, the fade. The fade has an early lead. The fade has an early lead. Oh, that's kind of crispy too. That's kind of what I'm looking like right now until I get a haircut on Friday. I doubt they went like full 2K and put like waves in the game and stuff like that. That's that. That's that. I just got out of bed and I need to. I need to get this right. Ooh, giving off. Giving off giving off little bow wow right there i don't know i might have to give him the little bow wow vibes <laughs> uh, okay i might have to give him the little bow wow vibes hold up hold up hold up i don't think i don't think i don't think i don't think the wizarding world has ever seen ever seen a wizard with braids so we gonna we gonna give him that should i should i flex on him with the hairstyles oh no not the Oh no, not the Haitian blonde. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm having way too much fun with this, but it's a video game. What else, what else do you expect? Isn't that what I'm supposed to do? Am I not supposed to have fun? All right, we just gonna give him the jet black. Scars and markings, complexion. Let's see what that does. Da, 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 da. No, 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 I wanna go back to whatever I started with. And once again, I want him, ooh, that rainbow right there. I want I want him to have some mystique to him. I want him to have some mystique. Like, who is this dude and why does he look like that? What, what's his story? Okay, okay, okay. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Is that Harry? I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Imagine. I am indeed a student, but a few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. That kind of sounds like me. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I can... A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing Wait to be concerned about. Wait a second, they all sound the same. That was quite something. 
I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I am indeed a student, but I could very a few cobwebs and some dust. Okay, Nothing so to be this, concerned about. This sounds like it's supposed to be the deeper voice. I kind of wanted a voice that would contrast my was, voice. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. Uh, he sounds like a baby right there. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. We'll just go with I'm eager right to get yeah. to Hogsmeade. The other ones sound a little bit too warped. And then for our wizard name, what, like, I mean, Charlie. We're going to go with Charlie. Um, yeah, we'll go with Charlie. Yep, 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 yep. Wingate. That sounds like a wizarding name, right? That sounds like a that sounds like a wizarding name. Okay, let's start our journey. We're swagged out. We got the cornrows in. We got the little facial scar. Hold on, I think I might change the scar. I want to change. I want to change the scar because I don't want a scar that like says, "Hey, this scar is my identity." But at the same time, I want a scar that like turns people's heads. I think that one might be it right there. That that's swaggy. That's GQ right there. That's GQ right there. He looked like Trey Songs. Yeah. Uh, okay, we out here. We out here. We out here. Professor, ah, Professor Fig, it appears we are bags. almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Yes, I will. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Oh, this game Eleazar, looks great. George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not your, at all, Your young what? After you. What Ages did he just since me? I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Yeah, someone's definitely following him. Like, he's mad sketched out. I forgot the name of these creatures, but I think they're the ones that you only can see if you see death. They're the same ones that pull the carriages at um, Hogwarts. Okay, okay, let's get in. Let's get into this. Let's get into this. I almost did the chair bounce, and that looked crazy. I did the, the chair bounce. You know what I needed right here? I needed that. That's what I needed right there, but it's cool. I'll take it. We're creating our own legacy. This is our own identity. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. Uh, I'm so swag. Oh my god. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Oh, so Professor, Professor Fig, Fig is, is not, not only an okay, exceptional he's a teacher. teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the ministry. <laughs> I thought Professor Fig Have was like the this? headmaster, but 
I guess they would have called him Headmaster, right? I Goblin have Rebellion. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry... Is that a dragon? ...is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this it was the last thing she sent me Eleazar. it came to me via her owl but with no correspondence to be honest bro i, I, I just started I, 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 I haven't even picked up my wand yet to keep it safe presumably from ranrock i'm only whispering because they're it. um they're they're doing the dialogue right now i don't want to talk over it indeed it looks like goblin <laughs> metal that symbol What's that glow? But my character is mad, mad, mad swagged out right now. Nor do I. We're probably going to be the swaggiest character to ever step foot in Hogwarts. That's going to be our legacy. What is this, like old magic? Okay, Merlin's okay. beard. How did you... Wait. We do... Oh! Whoa! <laughs> It was a dragon. Okay, I thought I was tripping for a second. He just got eaten on my first day, bro. Oh, there they are. So, there it is. Once again, once you see death, you can see them. Oh, this is he. They're giving us dragon on our first encounter. Arresto momentum. The key. Bro, we are about to die. We are in Game of Thrones right now. Thank you. Like, do some professor stuff. <laughs> Use that prime. Are you alright? Oh, Nika, I don't know. Ni I don't know you if Nika got prime. Perhaps a bit. I don't even know. <laughs> Take this. It's I thought you were talking about like Nick. I was like, Nick's in the stream too. A second. Oh my gosh, my character is so fly, bruh. And he has the generic outfit on, and he's still fly. What happened? Poor oh, George. I can't believe he. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? Oh, that's why we... bring whoever okay. touches it to a specific place. That's why we um, teleported. I thought he did that. I'm feeling better, sir. That if makes you'd sense, though. like to look around a bit. I would. But so stay he... close. So we, we were, were about to get created this port key. Or why? We were about to get eaten, and this dude went for the key instead of trying to save us? That's kind of crazy. The only reason we survived. Well, I guess, I mean, it was a W play because it's the only reason we survived. Okay, got my wand on me. I keep that thing on me at all times. Keep that thing, that, that, that thing, that thing, that thing on me at all times. Oh, this is so fire. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, it, it's only faded it may be. It's only my first day out here, but let's start the quest that might get us both killed. That's killing everybody else that follows it, right? Mind your step. You know what I mean? 
You know what I mean? If, if nothing else, we're gonna be fly through this playthrough. Look at the brains. Look at the swag. Look at the strut. I look like a boss. I smell God like a boss. I taste like a say. boss. A good question. <laughs> Miriam spent years searching for evidence oh, of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Okay, ancient so that's, magic. that's our little quest yes. thing. A power put it away? Right, nice. by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Oh my gosh, I, I'm so excited. Hogwarts I might be Castle more excited by, to like play this game than I was for Elden Ring, magic. which is nuts. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. Hold on, hold on. Let's let's get a let's get a quick flick. Oh, uh, it's only my third day out here. Well, technically, it's my first. Look at the sweat. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. But, sir, he got too much swag for a fifth year. I'll tell you that right lost now. Magic. Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Hmm. So basically me. It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent. Okay, so use your camera to select a active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick by disabling camera relative target settings. So basically it auto aims versus the, okay, I I'll stick with the auto aim. This is beautiful. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Look at this, ya. Yeah. Like, video games have come so far, man, and I'm loving it. So that would be my target? Okay, okay, I get it. We're close now, it's just ahead. Yo, Professor Fig, earlier when that dude called me a charge, what does that mean? You know, cuz- Steady yourself! Is he just gonna ignore me? Okay. Reparo! You just gonna do your little spell thing? Okay. Damn, when do I get to learn that? Professor Fig is kind of cool. He's giving Almost like... There. He's giving like Junior Dumbledore vibes. Like he ain't Dumbledore, but he's giving Junior. Even though I'm technically he's older than him. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. In other words, let's start shooting stuff. <laughs> Minimap shows your surroundings with you in the middle is your current objective. To toggle quest objective details. Okay, we did that earlier. <laughs> Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? Let's pull What's out this? our wand and figure it out. Professor Fitz! Is that me? Okay, so it's gonna get a little. You hear the Avada Kedavra whispering? How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? 
And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. Mm, so he can't see it, but I can. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. When he said Godric's heart, he, does he mean like Godric Gryffindor? Oh, it's probably just an expression. It's probably not actually. I was about to say, we went back in time or something? Hello? I know it's me, it's Charlie. I know, bro. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> Ooh. <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Oh, Gringotts. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Mm hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, so this is probably, the port key probably brings you to this a special way, part of Green Gods. Because you gotta remember, Green Gods is fully enchanted. So Stay maybe close. only a certain person can access this part of Green Gods, which is why he was sleeping. Because it's probably been years since somebody got to this part of Green Gods. Because the only way there is with the port key and through that passage, which it looks like only certain wizards can access. So, no, Felix, this isn't Dobby, bro. Keep your hands inside like, the keep car. up, Psych. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> so this this game takes place way before Harry Potter. So I don't think any any of the Potter characters are gonna be in this one. Maybe um like references. Obviously, like Godric Gryffindor, and um, fact, maybe Cor Nicholas Flamel might be in this too. So that speak, might be it. Just the main lobby. The vault you see now oh, this, is, this is cool. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? This is Vault insane, bro. This is a this is a shortly bank. after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Four centuries? Look at this dude, bruh. Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. What is that on his... They're, they're clearly trying to show us that. Maybe that's how they use their magic? I don't know. I think goblins have some magic capabilities too. Or magical cap capabilities. Professor, mm -hmm. the armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container? No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Maybe they're being controlled. Here we are. All right, let's do this. So far, so good, though. Accessed. 
A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Thank you for your help. So he's saying this is the first time someone's ever been to this vault. Vault? What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you the might- The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. This is so fire. They dropped us right. I love when games do this. Like immediately Professor, drop you into story unexpected. and immersion. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes. A revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Do. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Steady your wand with and guide it along the symbol's path. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol path. Oh, so I have to, like, direct it, too. Okay. Okay, okay. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, Revelio. That's a start. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Look, 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 yeah, look, I yeah. don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. Uh, that symbol okay. has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Like, dude, it, bro, it's, like, we haven't even started playing yet. Like, literally, when you jumped in, it just has been the, like, this the intro so far. Outside of the little gameplay you've seen, they haven't done much, but I love how they're making you just immerse into the story, into the presentation. Of this, this is, is fire. no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. It's true. You want to give that a little bit of, you know, Lumos Maxima so we can actually see where we're going? Cause you kind of you kind of hit in a hard right oh there we go i thought he was gonna just walk in circles i see something up ahead what is it that glow again but on the floor for some reason he can't see it Rebellion. i just love this spell hold on hold on no 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 don't leave me in the dark don't leave me in the dark don't leave me in the dark hold up yeah look at this look at this look at this oh uh, because the light hold on hold on look 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 Revelio. Oh, okay, okay. All right, let me stop. Let me stop. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Okay, so this is the game way of telling us whenever we see that little hint. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. You know? It is. <laughs> Revelio. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Revelio. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. There you go, Professor. Teach me all the spells. I need them all so I can become a great wizard.
All right, you have acquired the wand lighting charm, Lumos, which has automatically been slotted to your spell set. Lumos creates a light at the tip of your wand to help you see the dark in the dark areas. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Okay, so I'm starting to see how the the uh, spell the the control layout is. So regular regular tap is kind of just like your default weapon, and then your little arsenal is when you lift your wand Lumos. and then select a spell. Okay. Oh, this is so cool. These look like the, the guards at Hogwarts. Look out! Oh! That's a box then. What's up? Get it in, Professor Fig. Let me find out Professor Fig got hands, bro. Because in the Wizarding World, these are hands. Like, how you, how you use your wand? That's hands right there. How do I do Protecto or whatever? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ooh, they got spin. They have a spin. Okay, watch out. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yup, nope. Too slow. Oh, no, this is fire. This is like a Harry Potter Souls game. It's like Demon Slayer, but Harry Potter. Review objects to reveal a way forward. Oh, okay, okay. This is tutorial. This is tutorial. Yo, Professor Fig is like... Oh, okay, 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 okay. So I can parry. I can parry. Okay. Okay, that warns me when the attack is coming. Professor Fig. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. That's what warns me. Okay. okay. All right. I got it now. Let me sip, let me sip some of this yak real quick. All right. I get a little bit of Henny in the system. That I'm just drinking apple juice, you guys. I'm talking about his healing. His healing is his Professor, Hennessy. Professor Fig, <laughs> Professor. His healing potion. You? This isn't good. Yo, what's good, James? What's good, bro? We playing some Harry Potter, and I'm not gonna lie, this game is fire so far. This game is fire so far. Oh wait, wait, I got to do my spell. Lumos. Okay, okay, I almost forgot. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic me? seem to be leading oh, me somewhere. Oh, this is so fire. This game is a banger so far. I'm only maybe 30, 40 minutes in, and I am so immersed. Feels like I, it doesn't even feel like it's been ah, 40 minutes. That's where they're leading me. That glow Okay, so we gotta do it again. Oh no, we gotta. Revelio. Revelio. My own this time. <laughs> it's my favorite spell. Revelio. Hold on, hold on. Hit it one time for the. Hit it one time for the. For the chat. Lumos. Hit it one time for the Revelio. chat. Oh, uh, okay. Lumos. Oh, I gotta get all of them lined up. Okay. okay. Like this, no it has the perfect balance of detective and and combat so far. Like it's fire. Nope. I probably could have played this on hard mode. Nope. And then we got the roll in there too. Okay too early okay so protego is like my okay that's my parry that's my hennessy yup yeah, big attacks big attacks yup yep, yep, yep. 
I did not want to kill him. I wanted to practice that move again, but it's good. Cool. And then Lumos. Nice. Okay, okay. This is this game's kind of fire, y'all. It's kind of this shit. It's kind of cool, yo. This is kind of cool. It's kind of worth it. You hear the Avada Kedavra's whispering again? Like, look at this ominous feeling around me. Ooh, this is... So one thing about this game is it is a choose your path game. So even though you're in a certain house, you can choose if you want to be a dark wizard or you can choose if you want to be um, a good guy. Or maybe a little bit... There, There is like pacifism in this game, so... You, you have options. So maybe this magic that's luring us in, we can choose to wield it as dark magic and be more powerful or use it for good and kind of contain it. Typical light versus, uh, light versus darkness or good versus evil. How did you? Within story. What is this place? I don't know, but I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Is that a memory in there? Follow my lead. Getting comfortable over here, you guys. I'm I'm locking in right now. Oh, okay. I see the I see the um the uh the half blood prince. I see the half blood prince art style in there. I like it. Uh you want to be he who must not be named so bad. Is in place. The Willie that must Hopefully not be well. named. <laughs> <laughs> the path we've created may be impossible. Who is this, to Percival? It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles. The ritual wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. Hey. So it looks like Percival That's was the original see. user of this the glow magic. That surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. She couldn't see it herself. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But sir, I knew it. So the, the red band is, is controlled probably by this dude. Because there's the guard. There's the guard that had the red band. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? Hey? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... 
I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh, he was just doing I have his no job. Patience for traitors. Now, where were we? Is this a species I'm not war? Giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. You called him a traitor because he was a goblin too? Like, you know how many secrets are probably in, in this bank? And this is the only one he wanted? Professor Fig, get out of there, bro, before you get crushed. No Professor Fig! I'm over here like, Hermione, your wand, bro. Use your wand. Like you standing there watching like you don't have magic. Step up, Professor. Are you all right? Fine, sir. <laughs> Not Dobby, I've bro. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. <laughs> he seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. So well, this kind of seems we? like a species. Um, <laughs> it can't be. Maybe, maybe Ranrock is a species. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Let's turn up. Oh, all right. It's time. It's almost time to get sorted. It's almost time to get. Oh, it brought us to. It brought us to Hogwarts. Ooh, we pulled up to the school with so much swag on our first day. Okay. W intro. Hey, listen. The art of introductions in video games. It's so essential, and it's a lost craft. What a what a what a what a prelude! I was fully immersed for the past hour. What a prelude! Woo! Yes, this is gonna be my life for the next month, for the next two or three weeks. Let's do this. Bring it on! Oh my gosh, I'm so hyped for this. Professor oh. Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. So I think... Welcome. You're I know I probably missed time. it, but maybe Professor Have Black is the head, head headmaster? Okay, Charlie. Okay, you guys, so here we are. It is finally time to figure out which house ah, we are going to create yes. our legacy it's in. a bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Um, what was I going to say? I was going to say something earlier and it wouldn't let me pause the game. I forgot what it was, so yeah, we're here. Um, so let's see you came here with preferences and I'm pretty sure my answers are what's gonna determine what house I'm in Let's be honest. We're not here for class. We're here to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds mm. Indeed much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well Hmm I wonder. Come on, bro. What you thinking, bro? I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm, what is it? Mm, let's see. 
daring i wouldn't say too much curiosity is probably big loyalty ambition i think with this game it's ambition i want to become one of the greatest wizards ever that's my my, my only goal in this game and i don't feel like i'm gonna find all those answers within the walls of the is castle it ambition i may seem single-minded but it is important to go after what you want from life mm, there you go mm, interesting You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. So he only asked me two questions and placed me in a house? I mean, that's where they put me. That's where they put me, so I, I guess that means I I should be in House Slytherin, right? Right, you guys? That means I have to be House Slytherin. I should. The thing though is, I can choose my own house. Let's just see. Let's just see what the different options say. Gryffindor House, known for daring, bravery, and chivalry. Hufflepuff Hufflepuff House, known for patience, loyalty, and hard work. Ravenclaw for intelligence, creativity, and wit. Slytherin for cunning, ambition, and a hunger for power. I mean, I did just say that's how I was gonna approach this game with ambition and a hunger for power, so. There can be good power, right? You don't necessarily have to be evil if you come from Slytherin. Creativity, wit, boring. Loyalty, hard work, boring, daring, bravery, chivalry. We're gonna roll with it. I We're house slithering. Growing sense of ambition. If that's what he put us in, that's what we gonna do. Power. That's what we're gonna do. If that's what he put us in, that's what we're gonna do. House slithering. Let's do it. So I will say this you really quick. I did mad like. Harry Potter personality test before this. I got Hogwarts every time. They put me in Hogwarts every time. So why not mix it up? Big Slytherin house, big Slytherin house. Let's do this. Big Slytherin house. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. Huh? But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, Tree. I'm sure I mean, you it's, it's what you make it, I guess. Classes begin tomorrow. <laughs> I guess it's what you make it. Quite an entrance. You, it's there have been bad wizards from other um, houses. Professor so Weasley, would you be I'm so kind old, as to I, I want to be the, I want to be the first common. bad one out of Slytherin, it, but it did match, it did as match my saying, personality trait. So I would have, it would have been a contradiction if I didn't stick with it. Okay guys, so that was just my first hour of my playthrough in Hogwarts Legacy. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Once again, I am going to be playing this full game and full series over on twitch.tv slash dsmittytv. I'll put it like right here or I'll put it right here and the link will be in the description below. Feel free to come over and hang out with us during live streams. They will be a lot more frequent for the next few weeks. Once again, got some changes going on in life. Um, but if you did enjoy this video um, and you're excited to see the rest of this playthrough, um, just make sure you slap a like on the video, support the channel, and there will be more content on the way. A lot of the games that I'm playing on Twitch, I will be bringing over to YouTube. It's just easier for me to edit them and post them quicker. And then we will continue the series that we have going because I am going to finish Life is Strange True Colors. I'm not gonna leave that hanging and more Last of Us videos will be on the way. But until the next video, appreciate you guys. Peace.